So today I'm going to talk about abortion. In Brazil, it's considered a crime, and I'm going to explain why I think it should be allowed. To explain that, I'm going to focus on three main points: what the law says, the reality, and the Zika, that is a virus. It's like our topic right now. So, in Brazil, abortion is considered a crime, but it's only allowed when the, when the pregnant woman's life is in risk, and when she was raped, and when the kids is going, is going to be born without brain. But in the reality, a lot of people abort the abortions for multiple reasons, and a lot of them do it in illegal clinics because they don't have money and because they, it's not allowed. And that those illegal clinics, they don't have like hygiene conditions, and the people there are unprepared. So the pregnant women is under a lot of risks. She could become sterile and her uterus is going to be really damaged because of that. And now we're going to see the real numbers, how abortion really happens in Brazil. In 2015, over 1 million women had induced abortions in Brazil. And here in the northeast, it has the highest number because it's one of the poorest regions in Brazil. And people, a lot of people there don't have access to a quality education. So now we're going to see the relation between education and abortion. Number of abortions by liberal education. It's really obvious that like higher education like less is the number of abortions. Because when you have education you know about who can what you can do to protect yourself and all this stuff. And it's also related with the economic condition of the, the women there. And now we're gonna talk about the Zika. Uh, my family, we have a friend in Brazil that she had a baby and because of the Zika, the baby was born with microcephaly. So she, she didn't have money, so she quit her job to take care of him. And he couldn't walk or speak. And when he turned seven years old, he died because he couldn't like, his brain couldn't grow because of the size of his head. And people, this subject, is under discussion in Brazil because a lot of women want to abort, but they can't. And Zika is like raising a lot of questions there. Abortions are free in Brazil to prohibit is punishing those people who don't have money. So that quote fits in not just because of the abortion, but in the whole Brazilian society. Because there, who don't have money, don't have any kind of privilege, has a precarious education and health, but the health system is the worst, one of the worst in the world. So, yeah, it's really shown our reality.